As the sun rises, one of the world's smartest birds is already observing. The crow doesn't just survive, it strategizes. Crows adapt. In cities, they exploit human waste with precision, learning which containers yield the best rewards. Some crows drop nuts on traffic crossings, timing it perfectly, letting cars do the cracking. That's learned behavior. In the wild, crows craft tools, twigs, wires, even plastic. They don't just find solutions, they invent them. In experiments, crows have solved eight-step puzzles, showing planning, memory, and logic once thought uniquely human. Cross a crow dot dot dot, and it remembers for years. They recognize human faces and never forget those who've harmed them. Crows live in tight-knit family groups. Older siblings help raise younger ones. Cooperation is taught, not just inherited. When a threat appears, crows call allies. They coordinate aerial attacks, protecting their own with military-like strategy. In tests, some crows recognize themselves in mirrors, a sign of self-awareness once limited to primates and dolphins. When a crow dies, others gather, not to mourn, but to learn. A crow funeral is a memory lesson and a warning. Studies show crows can remember over 100 human faces. Not just enemies, but friends too. Crows don't always learn the hard way. They observe others, copy success, and avoid mistakes. Some crows hide food and relocate it later. Others fake a hiding spot to throw spying rivals off track. Urban crows know traffic patterns, garbage days, even park closing times. Their city memory rivals GPS. They learn routines. One crow arrives just before school ends. It knows snack time means opportunity. Tool use isn't instinctual. It's taught. Crows pass intelligence to the next generation like we do language. Territories are remembered and defended. A single call can alert all eyes of a trespasser within seconds. Not everything is survival. Crows play, not randomly, but with intent. Intelligence loves stimulation. Even at dusk, crows make their final rounds. They remember the day's missed chances and explore them one last time. As night falls, crows gather in massive numbers. They roost together, exchanging signals, memories, and warnings. Scientists believe roosting isn't just for safety, it's social learning. Young crows observe, listen, and absorb knowledge from their flock. Some crow groups share discoveries passing objects, tools, or food strategies within tight social circles. A crow doesn't hold a grudge alone, it tells others. Studies show entire flocks remember your face and spread the word. Each crow is unique. Their calls, faces, and personalities differ. In their world, identity matters. Like humans, crows may dream. Their brains remain active at night, perhaps replaying lessons, memories, and even threats. Some crows return to places where they lost a mate or companion, displaying a memory of grief and a refusal to forget. Knowledge isn't lost. Crows build generational memory passing on strategies that become cultural habits. We walk beneath them every day unaware that some of the most intelligent creatures on Earth are watching and remembering. The day begins again, but for the crow, nothing resets. Every experience is stored, weighed, and remembered. They may look like ordinary birds, but inside that small black skull is one of the smartest minds in the wild. If animals think like this, what else don't we know? Subscribe and question everything.